So, ain't it a story and we got the fairing and the windshield off. Went okay. Um, we went over, we had to travel on some dirt road to get here and that was the first issue I've had keeping the uh, tablet on. It was actually, the mount is one of those slip type where it just kind of slips down and then um, friction holds it. It was flipped the wrong way so it just fell down backwards. So I got that switched around. I'm surprised that it shook off that way before anything else. Um, this mount, I have my $12 mount. Fantastic, still has not moved, even on those really bad washboards. So, this oil leak down here, I, I don't know what's going on with it, but as you can see, we've got oil leaking out of the alternating area, coming down, and then it, and there's not a lot of oil getting down on the... Uh, a skid pan or the skid plate and dripping on anything I was a little bit I've been sitting here for a little while it's cooled off um, and I've checked the oil and it's still right there so I don't think it's leaking enough that I need to worry about it um, or that I'm losing through the breather hose you can see my tire not looking uh, too good with plenty of oil on it but it's cruising down the road at 55 to 65 no problems we're fully loaded um, I'm sure that a lot of people see this and they're gonna say oh man that's you know that's way too much for the rack um you know it's it's not that sturdy well that may be and it may break and i probably not supposed to put it on my spare i'll probably bend my rim but that's how i've got it down and we're gonna see if we can make it up the way that way still haven't had to fill up we went 106 miles so that's pretty good and we've got about 10 miles to go before we hit the gas station I have not had to use my spare tank at all, which has been good. So we will see if everything holds for us um, as we get up on the mountain. 